that's kind of interesting. The last time you have to wonder, he's had that figure. More, more rebounds and points. Smith, the follow. That's a big play because Spider Smith lost the ball and nobody touched it. That could have been traveling. Only his second hoop of the night. Four points for Charles Smith. And it puts New Mexico up by two. Andre Miller tries, splits the seam, and he gets the bucket. 21 for Andre Miller. We're tied at 70, under a minute to play. What a huge night for Miller. Miller with 21, Lamont Long with 23 to lead New Mexico. Now, if you're New Mexico, do you look for the freshman Lamont Long, or do you look for the veterans in Charles Smith, Clayton Shields, or Kenny Thomas? I say you go with the hot hand. He feed Thomas, and he walked. Walk first. And Derek, he was surprised. He was so he open. Was exactly, Greg. Absolutely. He got the ball on the block. Look, nobody was in front of him, and he saw his eyes got so big, he realized he could get to the basket. Take a look. He looks. Nobody's there, and he hops. He does a little bunny hop instead of taking it up. 14th tie of this game. 70 all. And the clock's running under 30 seconds to go. Van Horn was the hero last night against SMU. New Mexico, Derek. two fulls, Derek. Utah with one. Rick might want a timeout here. Oh, oh boy, Goliak almost threw it away to Caton. 14 on the shot. There's about a second that the difference between shot and game clock. If you miss it, you go to overtime. Don't worry about it. Miller, the floater off the glass. Goliak tried to follow Van Horn. Will he get it? He night for the Utes. They came from behind. The lead went back and forth. They did a great job to stay in this game, give themselves a chance, come up with another huge victory to get to the finals of the WAC Conference Championship. The money man, the final score from Las Vegas, Utah advances to the finals 72-70. Center is next.